buds. We are at the beginning of a new grow. We've got to get our tent all cleaned up. Well, in this case, our grow closet. Um, we're going to clean out the drying racks. Both have a little bit of residue bud left in them, but uh, we'll vacuum it out and get them stored away for the end of the grow. Um, and then from there, we're going to wipe down all the walls in here, get the light set back up. Uh, I like to clean the walls with a bleach and water solution. So I'll kind of, I think usually I do like two to one, three to one, something like that. Uh, just enough to get kill any bacteria, any parasites, anything that's left in the tent. It shouldn't be anything we had we could throw last. There wasn't too many, uh, or that I noticed any parasites or anything like that, or bad mold, nothing like that. So it shouldn't be too bad. I just like to do it just for precaution. Um, stay with me and we'll get into this. Peace. All right, we're back. Got the light in the air, got some shades on, a little bit bright now. Uh, next thing to do is wipe down these walls, a little bit of bleach and water, two to one ratio. From there, we're going to pop some seeds next week. Uh, looking at doing Gorilla Glue number two, or some Chem Dog. All I'm gonna do one of each, two plants total. I'm gonna do 25 gallon pots. From there, hopefully get some decent sized uh, buds off of it, because we're gonna do as much training as possible this time around as well. So we're gonna really fill out, fill out these plants in this room and hopefully we're gonna fill this room with just two plants. I wanna see what kind of yield I can get out of it. It's kind of my new little experiment. I think it'll be a little fun. Nice video to do, nice little series. So let's get ready. Remember, hit that subscribe button down below because we're close to 100 subscribers. Thank you to everyone who subscribed because it really means a lot to me. Didn't think I'd be, you know, actually getting that many people following me, so it's great. So let's keep this going. Uh, remember, I also have an Instagram. I'll link that down below. I usually post some stuff on there when I don't post on uh, YouTube. Usually just when I'm in the grow room doing some stuff, I'll post like a couple pictures of plants and you know, quick little updates. So make sure you subscribe. See you guys next week. I'm gonna go clean this room. Peace out.